What's going on everybody? This is Bronco Juggalo and today I'm doing another find video. Went to some secondhand stores today and I found some cool shit. I'm going to start with DVDs and then the VHSs because I'm really excited about the VHSs today. The first thing I want to show is this. My TV VCR combo. I pulled it out of my garage after 10 years and it still works. Woohoo! Now I can watch some of these movies I've been collecting on VHS. The voice is almost back to normal. Uh, but it goes out the more I talk and the more I do stuff. Uh, Hallow's End. I've never seen this, but it looked kind of interesting. It's a Halloween-related title, horror movie, and it just looked kind of cool. Then we have another one I've never seen, but it looked kind of interesting. Dark Asylum. I think I saw the preview for this on the DVD of uh, Boondock Saints 2. Harry Brown, starring Michael Caine. This movie looks really intense. Uh, one I've been looking for for a while now and I found. Cut. Definitely wanted to get this movie. I've been looking for it for a while. It's got uh, Molly Ringwald in it. So the audio for this section got messed up. I know that Jason will be happy I found this video. It is, of course, Stephen King's Apt Pupil. And I just know that he would be happy I found it. I've been very glad to find it because I've been looking for it for a while. So the VHS is I picked up. This first one is a little weird maybe, but I picked it up because I've always been liked this movie. And it's never gotten an official DVD release. But I've really always liked it. It's got Keanu Reeves and Drew Barrymore. And it is Babes in Toyland. I don't know why, but I've always liked that movie. We have the Amityville Curse. Night of the Living Dead. And this one's different than the other one I have. This is an Anchor Bay release. I found another copy of Godzilla 1985. Saw. Probably one of the last VHSs they made. <laughs> Cape Fear. And it's got this really cool metallic case to it, like shiny foil looking art. This one I thought was really cool. Um, I really, I don't think I'll ever watch it. I just got it because it's a collector's edition. It is a Mr. Rogers VHS. But up here on top, and it's still sealed. It's still sealed. It's an Anchor Bay release, still sealed. And it has a trolley, one of the toy trolleys. Right up there. I thought that was kind of cool. I don't know if that's worth anything, but it's cool. I got Tremors. I'm not a huge fan of this movie, but it's not bad. The sequels all suck. I found Game of Death, starring Bruce Lee. And this one has a really nice case. It's really in good shape. Stephen King's Thinner. This one I've never heard of, but I thought it was cool looking. Revenge of the Dead. From Creature Feature Entertainment. I got a collector's edition of Close Encounters of the Third Kind, which is in this really nice metallic shiny case. It's actually made of, like, plastic. Or at the very least it has a plastic coating. And I thought that was really cool. I thought these were absolutely awesome. I had to pick them up. Two different or two different videos. They're like books. I mean, they're not those. They're not regular clamshell cases like you'd see on a Disney. I thought these were really interesting. They're literal like cardboard books. And you open it up, and there's the tapes inside. Which unfortunately, the lady that owned them put her address stickers across them. But oh well. Still really cool. I absolutely thought these were awesome. I love MASH, and I've never seen these before. I thought this was really cool. And finally, guys, the one that I am most excited about, the one that really got my goat today. Um, people talk about their holy grails. Well, to me, this is a holy grail. It might not be to others, but it is to me. I found a blockbuster version 
Blockbuster Presents of John Carpenter's Halloween. Now, this is just the case because I actually have the movie in the TV. So, it's really good. It's really nice. The case is in a little bit of warm, but pretty decent condition. And the, uh, the VHS is in great condition. So, I thought this was one of the most awesome finds ever. I never find Halloween stuff on VHS. The only one I think I've ever found is Halloween Resurrection. I never see any other Halloween on VHS. So to find the original, and not only is it original, but it's a blockbuster version, that's just cool. So that's it for my finds today, guys. Thank you for tuning in. Glad to see everybody. Thank you for checking out my videos today, my Slashback Saturday and my find video. Happy Slashback Saturday, guys. This is Bronco Juggalo saying peace.